Hello and welcome to the second episode of Farmer Against Potatoes. This is the first time I record with a boon arm and puff filter. That means my voice might sound different in future videos. I'll do my best to make it sound pretty good. Okay, so today we'll look at reincarnation. But I got interrupted. I wanted to go a little further. My goal was to reach the point where I would be ready for a second reincarnation and stop there. But I will unlock challenges today, so I had to stop because I did not want to look at that. So next episode will be about challenges. I'm already working on it. So let's um, go in one nine. And uh, on the thumbnails, I write which area I'm in. I might write my reincarnation level instead. We'll see. I might change all the thumbnails eventually also. It's a work in progress. So 40 levels after incarnation. So I'm not sure. There's one thing I don't understand yet is the level versus the reincarnation point that I get. We'll look at it and I'll try to pay attention because there's a place where I put the help section of reincarnation. Here I was trying by the way to get the 25% more XP. I won't be able in this reincarnation, but next one I will be able to. Okay, and that's well, is it next episode or no? Because we're going to move forward in the second reincarnation in this video. I'm just not sure if I'll reach that goal in this video. I don't remember exactly either this video or next video. That's going to help getting more. Now here is 93 levels after reincarnation. And the way it works is for talents, talent points, right? Or I call them skill points, or the talent points. It's one per 100 level of all class combines. So right now I'm, in, I'm at 737. So if I reincarnate, I have seven points. One thing I did, I didn't talk about it because I was distracted. I kept one point in the tree unspent, okay? To see if I would be at eight points. And look, I'm at seven. So you cannot bank the points and I can see why I guess uh, it would be probably an exploit you could have you would bank a bunch of points and reincarnate right so um, plan is to try every single class one by one and then level them up evenly okay so this class is more about attack power strength things like this each have their own specialization and the first one that we had, the farmer, is, is um, balanced, completely balanced. But what I want to do is, everybody... So I would always um, choose the class that's the lowest level. That's my initial plan for now. There's also Ascension. I don't know what this is about. I didn't read about it. So here, I still have to do this manually. Eventually, I won't have to. So the progress for cosmetics remains. We keep our equipment, so that's two good things. And let's take a look at our reincarnation point. I got 23 points and I'm level 93. So is it uh, every four level you get one point? I don't know yet, okay? So this is for uh, auto upgrade potatoes. Mm. Auto upgrade skulls is only one level per thing. This one's attractive because it auto auto uh, progresses for you, so you can AFK the game and you'll move ahead in the game. So that's cool. So this one is also nice. If I don't feel like doing, it's not whack a mole, it's whack a potato. I can click a button and I get a buff, which is pretty good. Okay. This one is hard to fully understand. Maybe you can help me in the comments. You get two inventory slots. It just sounds like I get better items, but I don't really understand with the wording. It, so please let me know in the comments in more details. And also this one, does it mean that I get double? Let's say I click on the talent node that gives me one strength. Do I get double? Do I get two strength instead? Is that what it means? Please let me know in the comments also. I need help with that. The rest, I understand it. So I uh, will buy these two things. So this one will help a lot. Because I have the game in the background with no sound or nothing. See, SN, 
it was pretty fast, but there's something about Ascension. Very interested in this. Now, once we reach Reincarnation level 100, we'll have access to the boosting corner. That would be next episode. Okay, not this episode. We'll reincarnate only once in this episode. We already did. Here, you can... Uh, well, I'll show it later, but... Well, let's look at enchanting. Is it what we're going to do right now? I think I'm going to look at enchanting first. Very straightforward. I got some mass here. And uh, I can just spend some materials to enchant. And it gets more expensive over time. When I... I'll call it salvage. When I get rid of my equipment, I salvage it for mats. I can also... It's called trash and common, right? I can turn trash into common. I'll show you that. So I can... Um, the lower tiers, I can make them higher tier. I'll show that also. I didn't know that. By the way, you see the bag? Below it, there's two spaces. What is it? What is it? Please let me know in the comments. It's a mystery for me. Okay, 1, 4, 51. So let's see if worms uh, keep their progress. So I sped out the footage here because it was a bit long. And it doesn't, unfortunately. But we have good news. Warm larva. We're going to get our first warm larva today. And those, for all I can say, is they remain. Because I'll reincarnate again. Well... You'll see next episode. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to give away what happened. Something happened next episode. See, seven uh, hours. Uh, probably in my sleep, I guess. Very generous. That's pretty nice. Offline rewards. Cannot complain. I don't know what the maximum is. Is it 12 hours? 24 hours? The longer, the better. Especially for a person like me who plays so many games. Only 22 levels after reincarnation. Not enough. Look, one warm larva. I'll attribute it later to attack. Okay. And here's 1000 above. Again, 1050, 250, 1000. I made that up. I can always change them if I need to. Very useful. I like how customizable it is. Potato bowls. We'll get access to new um, new ones later. So don't worry, we're not going to look at all that, but there is one piece of equipment. So this is a nice one, but I prefer the other one. So I'll choose the other one. And in fact, I got rid of this. I, I said, ah, oh, it's not enough. <laughs> the bar is high, I guess. Ah, this one's a little better. 8.9% skulls earns. Skulls. Hmm. Luck uh, went down a little bit, but yeah. Uh, so <laughs> I didn't notice. I double click. I was like, "What? What did I just do?" So I just enchanted those gloves with my very few rare tier three mats, and I continue to you know get rid of everything. Really. So uh, if I click on this, I can see the item level and the enchantment level. I would never have bought this, but it came with a starter pack that I bought. Here's a code, okay? Found that on Discord. I invite you to join their Discord because they... Uh, I'll keep it in the uh, description down below for the whole series. They have codes. There's new today, a new codes today. Uh, I think two new codes today or something. Anyways, I'll have to check. So I just attributed warm larva and it's plus 10% XP per warm larva. Now I'm a noob, so they're super rare. So how rare are they when you're more advanced? I don't know. Let's do one Waka Potato run. One of my better runs so far. And then I'll uh, look at every single upgrade because I promised that last episode, didn't I? So we'll look at that. I think in the future I'll reach absolutely ridiculous number. You'll see why. It seems at first I didn't understand what the red face was. I think if you're too slow to click on a potato, it turns red. Like here, but I'm not sure exactly. I didn't seem that slow. I don't know. 
C2630 is one of the highest I ever got. So this is nice because there's 1,000 levels and increases how many points you get per whack. That's a lot of levels. Gains duration, okay, we can increase by 30 seconds. Shield, we're gonna buy a second shield. Very useful to keep my combo. And we got max combo. Uh, I think my max combo is 10 plus 10, so it must be 20. Increase my chance for gold potato and decrease the chance for green potato. And this is uh, every time I hit a potato, I would get plus two combo instead. That would become necessary eventually if my combo is too high and I won't, don't even have time to reach it. And those are the buffs, you can improve them, okay? And you can see there's a bunch that are still locked. In the future, there will be new, uh, there will be more available buffs uh, from this game. Waka Potato. Inventory slot is good. No. Talent loadout, I don't really understand it, but it doesn't seem very attractive. And custom input already bought it, and there's more to unlock. It's a fun mini game, and if I compare it to Idle Research where there's solitaire, it's much better. See that button I was talking about? I just hit it, and we're going. This is times four speed. We're gonna beat one nine one hundred and reach the second world. I call them world. Is that a correct uh, the correct name? It's like in Clicker Rose too. Same thing. Zone area world. Okay, so these are considered bosses. I would call them elite mobs. When I saw boss in the daily quest, I expected a big mutated potato, but that's not the case. Here I'm clicking all over the place looking for a secret achievement. There is one. I was just not clicking at the right place. It's somewhere in the building. I broke the window. It didn't work. You, you don't see that on the footage, but eventually I'll get it without recording. So if you click maybe one of the doors or something like that, you're going to get a secret achievement got 20 points if you look at the top that's because i'm probably waiting for the 25 points for um, more xp reincarnation xp okay probably and here i get interrupted because i unlocked probably at two to one i unlocked challenges and of course I had to stop here because I wanted to uh, get into challenges and we'll look at that next episode. So I'm not going to click on anything. I want to keep it uh, separate for simplicity reasons. So plus 56 if I reincarnate now. I'm higher level, 839, 840. Every 100 point I get one talent point and it's 5 for 1. So every five reincarnation level, I get one reincarnation point. Not four for one, that's because there's a plus one somewhere in there. So you can rewind if you want to read it. Okay, okay, that makes sense. I went ahead in the video during the voiceover to uh, read in advance. Okay, so I didn't want to reincarnate, but it would not be that bad. Okay, because I would get 15 talent points when I start. But because I'm at the point where I can look at challenges. Uh, I'm not going to push any further, okay? And next episode, we'll see what's going to happen with those uh, challenges. We'll look at them, okay? Of course, we'll reincarnate also. I already have half a video of footage. It's pretty quick. And look at this an all range weapon. Nice. First time I see that, of course, I will equip this. And if you look at the top right, you can see that I don't have any uh, trash um, mats anymore. If you click on them, it offers you to convert the lower level to the current level. Okay, so I've done that a little bit. That's why you see 11.3 or partial numbers. So that's going to help a lot. Again, eh, under the bag, the two spaces, I don't know what they are. <laughs> I need your help. Um, so this is my equipment and look, that's it for now. Next episode about challenges, we'll take a look at them. We'll, I'm in the middle of one right now and we'll talk about that. I hope you like this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and leave a comment below. 
If you want to support this channel, you can subscribe and hit the notification bell to make sure you don't miss future videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.